right, I am finally back with another video. I spent $54 on baits at my local bait store since the other local one, one of the walls fell and they can't <laughs> really do anything right now. But this one is called, this bait shop is called The Angler. And I got some good stuff, so let's get into All it. All right, we, here's the stuff. So let's take it out one by one. Since it's the fall season and paddle tail baits kick back in, we got the Big Bite Baits Watermelon Red Ghost 5 inch cane thumper. Let's take it out. Oh, it's one of those older models, or not models, older bags that they had. Rip and tear. Ooh, greasy. That's what the cane thumper looks like. Looks really good. Looks like something yum would make, almost. Looks like you can rig it from the side, almost. Belly rig it, side rig it, I don't know. It's got those lines on the side that look like you can rig it. We got the old Z-Man worms. Salted, impregnated worms okay green pumpkin finesse worm four inches this looks like a berkeley <coughs> sorry looks like a berkeley flute worm almost and basically all the most of the soft plastics that i got are in from the bargain bin and they were all half off due to like people showing people how to rig it and stuff like this baits these bargain bins were full to the brim and they had a lot of good stuff, mostly paddle tail swim baits, because people like that. This is the Z-Man worm, worms, finesse worm. I mean, that looks good. <coughs> oh my gosh, sorry. Um, yeah, I could use that. Put that on a little one on, I guess. That's the second thing. Oh, you know how you can get these at Dick's for like, I don't know, $7.99? I got this for $2. The Little Dipper. Nine count. Sungill. Let's take a closer look at the Sungill. Alright. That is the Sungill. Looks really good also can belly rig it i normally will just throw this on a s underspin or a little spinner bait see my underspin is like a four out so it will probably go down to here but we will see <coughs> um we got another reaction innovations uh skinny dipper california 420 um seven count two dollars it's basically just green pumpkin, rough flake. A lot bigger, more suitable for my underspin. Indeed, can belly rig it. Yeah, that looks really good. Um, let's see. Let's keep going with the uh, half off baits or discount baits in the client section. Got another little dipper. This is, I don't know, this is just a shiner, I guess. Looks like a really good packaging. Now, I have never heard of this brand, Renegade Lures. It's a worm with a pink tail. It almost looks like a jelly worm, but it's not. And this looks like it was given to them. So let's open it. Oh, jeez. Maybe an old packaging, but it is greasy. <coughs> oh my gosh. I've been hearing black worms are really good, so I picked up one of those. We're down to the last four items. Let's keep going on the staff. soft plastic trail. Oh, five. Um, we got the Secret Lures Stupid Tube. This was not discounted, but 
basically it's the there's two i normally go with a tube and a rattle that's what i've been hooking most of my bass on super salty yeah it's a really good tube if for you that don't know what a tube is they're basically just a hollow bait and you put either a weighted hook through here and stick the uh line thing <coughs> oh my gosh <coughs> oh jeez line hook just the where you tie your line here and then the hook just sticks out here but then you can also put the hook through the top and then rig it through there which that's what I do and then I put a rattle between it really good idea all right back again with the half boss items there is KVD mustad two dollars these normally go for I don't know um uh five six dollars <laughs> two dollars and three dollar quantity five there's four because someone must have took it out showing how to rig it i can understand that and this was at the bottom of the bargain man i'm glad i looked through there i saved the last three items that i think i'll catch some really nice fish on is mega bass dark sleeper in the bluegill color wait i don't know what color this is and not Hannah Hayes. That's the one that I thought most likely looks like a bluegill. <coughs> Jeez. Half ounce, six ninety nine. I bet you can get them at Bass Pro Shop for like I don't know, uh, like five ninety nine. Oh, here we go. I've been dying to use these. Six forty nine for these little jigs, but they've got Gamagatsu hooks, one eighth ounce, and you can put your own weedless thing, plastic things in to the jig head. I guess they're just Ned, Ned rigs, and they got a skirt on them. Uh, yeah. Optional weed guard, but I've been dying to get more of these. I used to get my jigs at the we'll give it, the Wookieville bait store and it they got ever since the wall collapsed I can't go there anymore now I got the best for last an $18 lure well 19 drum roll please mega bass pop x this was the best purchase I ever made now this i'm kind of glad because <coughs> oh geez <coughs> but as you can see in the mouth right there there's pockets and they can slaunch the water farther which i'm happy to see now i'm taking this to atwood where i normally fish so yeah i'm gonna save that in the packaging same with the half ounce dark sleeper but I'll take one of these jigs to Atwood, but I'll open one just to get one out. All right. If I can move the skirt. All right. Hold on. Said all right two, three times now. All right, there. That's the jig. Yeah, this is the skirt. Or not the skirt, the weedless weed guard. So let me see how I can. I'm gonna cut it so I can find out how I put the weed. Alright, I figured it out. Alright, there. Cut the weed guard and everything. I mean, I was gonna pay for it either way because 
I need more jigs like this because that's what all I've been catching these bass on is mini jigs, like one eighth ounce or one fourth ounce. <coughs> oh, jeez. Been really sick lately. That's why I haven't been posting. I couldn't go outside either to fish as much as I used to. But that is the mini Ike's micro jigs. And yeah. That's about it, so thanks for watching and see you later.